add Google uh, AdWords in your Coco Studio X project along with uh, the latest Xcode. Xcode. So first thing first, uh, create a new group called let's say Frameworks and just for simplicity drag it here at the bottom. You don't have to drag it but and I have a Google Ads SDK here just manually add these files in this framework make sure this is selected and finish it once this is done go to build settings and do these things first go to c plus type c plus plus in the linker make sure there is nothing extra here you don't need anything i'll show you how to make this work and then second of all in other uh, in objective c uh, oh, there is this place. Let me show you. Enable Objective C exceptions, and all these should be enabled. And uh, other linker. Other linker. Right. Please add Objective C here at the bottom. And then uh, once you are done with this, then basically go to build phases and add this link binary with libraries you can go here and click on add link with libraries and then uh, add one of each one of these if you do it after adding it should automatically do it for you once once you have added the frameworks just click on link binary with with libraries and it should automatically do this for you now another thing which you need to do is how, how to actually use this. So remember this is an Xcode a project, an iOS project. So we want to make sure we can run both uh, on Android projects and iOS projects. So I have, I have a link in the description of the video which basically creates ads for you. You need to set a view control everything. So I don't have to change uh, my uh, app controller.mm file. Actually, I need not change that to make this work. And similarly, I don't have to change this file. Uh, just discarding some changes I have. So all of these changes, no changes needed. All you need to do is add these files like this, Objective C, and uh, then go to your main code. Uh, your home scene and call show bottom Google ad and go to your uh, app delegate where I actually add load Google ads but this is again op uh, optional you can add it anywhere uh, after preferably after the application has finished launching and then another thing which you need to do is actually go to your select the target and go to your info and add your application identifier is a very important thing once you're done with this then i think everything should work uh, if you have any query please put it in the description below thank you